What's going on everyone? It's Brain with Jacoji Fine Jewelry, your personal jeweler. To be honest with you guys, I feel a little under the weather today. I'm like Michael Jordan game six with the flu game. I'm going to give you guys an epic video because it's time to do an official Byzantine chain video. So let's get started. Real quick, guys, fellow subscriber and client of mine, Sean, uploaded and a review of a rope chain he bought for me. I'll insert a little preview clip here. Also, with the with the local ones, they couldn't tell me what the gram weight on them was. So really, I had no idea what I would be ordering. So I went on. It's definitely worth your time to watch that video. He did complete from contacting me all the way to getting his chain, his impressions, and going forward, kind of his thoughts on the purchase all in all. Very honest video. I appreciate it. Anytime anyone says I'm going to make a review, it's kind of nerve-wracking to be honest with you guys because I want everyone to be happy and I won't stop until you're completely happy. Um, any reviews that you guys make and post, I'll add it to the Jacoji Reviews. It's a playlist that I just made. So go check that playlist out, Jacoji Reviews. There's three total reviews there and maybe that'll help you. If you get a chain, want to do a review, please do it, upload it. I'm not going to put like hate videos on there because I know in time those will come. We'll ignore those. But anyone that has a review, good, bad, in between, it doesn't matter. I'll put it on there so everyone get the honest truth. With all that being said, please smash that like button. Smash, 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 smash. Here are the different Byzantines we're looking at today. This one right here in front is the two. Then we got the two and a half, three, four, five, six. And then the big one right here is the eight millimeter, 300 plus grams for a 28 inch. It's nothing short, but an extremely heavy chain. For the bracelets, we have a four, five and seven millimeter width so check these out so a little bit about the byzantine chain it was first founded in 18 no i'm just joking if i was to really explain and compare the byzantine chain to you guys i would say it's a hybrid of the big three that we all know and love the rope chain because of the intricacy of the of the circles and how it's made the Franco chain, because it kind of has the shape of a nice Franco, has the weight, and also the Miami Cuban link. Why the Miami Cuban link? Because it has that presence, the visual presence of a nice solid chain. Now, I'm a bigger guy. I need a chain like that if I'm just going to rock it solo. I wouldn't wear this all the time, and to be completely honest with you guys, if it was my money, I would not invest it in a 300 plus gram Byzantine chain because I do like the other three better, but worldwide, this is a very highly sought after chain because of the intricacy because of the detail and the overall design check me out here i got the six millimeter 24 inch and i still got the big boy eight millimeter screenshot that um and this is the thing this is close to 500 grams solid 14 karat gold you could do the math and this is why i don't really understand those little diamond tennis chains this is kind of besides the point but you could get this much gold and this big of look for the same price as one of those skinny choker diamond tennis chains. That's why I love and recommend just going with gold because you're going to be a big baller like I am right now. So this is a two chain look. I don't know if anyone has that type of money to go buy two Byzantines, a six to eight millimeter and two chain it. But there you guys have just a size comparison. There's a big comparison in two millimeters between the six and the eight and obviously the weight as well. Just like the Franco's or Miami Cuban link. These things jump up drastically in weight and price. If you're looking for a nice everyday chain and you love the Byzantine, I would direct you to either the 4 or 5 millimeter. I have the 24 inch 5 millimeter Byzantine on right now. And just look at the gold. Look at the way it's shining. High quality piece. But again, 100 plus grams for a 24 inch length. You have to love it. You have to be sold on this design. I wouldn't, if you're on the fence and just not really sure, I would direct you it to another chain that you're definitely sure of because that's a lot of grams and a lot of money for a hundred plus grams. So definitely heavy, but it feels good around the neck, especially if you're going to wear it on like a shirt like this, people will definitely take notice. I have the four and five on both at 24 inches and I love, I'm a sucker for same length chains. Don't matter if the widths are different, chain styles are different. I love this look right here. Let's split them up. This is the four millimeter. This is the five millimeter. Kind of hard to tell. You really got to shop. This is one of those things we got to go on the website and look. Is it worth it to go up to the five millimeter or should I just stay at the four millimeter? When we're talking three millimeters down, people email me about half sizes. I always kind of recommend to go up. It's just worth it because the sizes are so small. But four plus millimeters, 
I think you can get away just fine with the four millimeter and still have it as a nice everyday chain, especially because of the weight of these chains. Here I have the three millimeter 22 inch. I love the 22 inch for a lot of reasons. Um, everyday length, that is my sweet spot, the 22 inch. And the three millimeter is a nice chain, but at this size, three millimeters down, it's hard from a distance to really distinguish what kind of chain I have on. If I'm back here, you might guess Franco, you might guess Rope. Um, but up close and with the bigger chains, you definitely can distinguish that it is a Byzantine. You can see the link pattern on that chain. So that's something to keep in mind. The three, two and a half, two millimeters, they all kind of have that same look to them. Here's a quick look at the bracelets. Um, you got the seven millimeter, the four and five. These ones are seven inches. They don't fit me. Eight inch is my preference, but just so you guys can get an idea, if I was to get a Byzantine, it would definitely be a bracelet. I love them as a bracelet because of the unique look and just look how solid those things are. They definitely are stylish. Here are the clasps for the Byzantines. On the two millimeter, you have the traditional lobster clasps. And then as you get larger, obviously the gram weight, they come with bigger clasps, more heavy duty, the bigger lobster clasps. And then just look at that eight millimeter clasp. That thing's the size of my thumb. Um, bracelets, same thing. You have the larger lobster clasps. One last look at everything that we talked about today and saw. Go on my website. I got all these chains on there. Shop per gram length. It'll calculate so you can see a price. Let's start saving up for a nice Byzantine chain. Solid 14 karat gold stamped on the clasps. Everything is legit. Everything is high quality. Thank you for watching this video and we will see you on our next jewelry video.